hi guys and welcome back to the crochet toy youtube channel in today's video i'm doing another free pattern review and this time i'm going to be showing you this pattern for this harry potter mandrake that i found online so it's quite small um but yeah i made this for my sister's birthday because she really likes harry potter um so i'll just tell you a bit about the pattern and who created it as well so in terms of where i found this pattern i just googled free harry potter crochet patterns and this one came up on a website called amigurumi space um and as i mentioned obviously this is a free pattern so there's no payment required for this um, and I think I'd say the level of difficulty for this one is quite beginner as you can see it's quite small um, and there's not too many different parts to it um, the stitches used were just chains single crochet increases and decreases I don't think there was anything else used in the pattern um, and then in terms of the author of the pattern itself so this was created by someone called crochet underscore paladin on instagram um, so I just checked their instagram it looks like they've got a fair few followers so about 11 thousand followers um, and there were a lot more amigurumi free patterns on that amigurumi space website as well so i'll link that down below in case you're interested in seeing what else is on that website um, then in terms of the mandrake that i made so i used dk yarn with a 2.5 millimeter hook and this is how it came out the pattern did actually suggest to use a one millimeter hook so that one would have turned out even smaller but i didn't want it to be too small so i'm quite happy that i decided to use the 2.5 millimeter crochet hook for this one um, and i would say that it took me about two to three hours to fully complete this um, it wasn't too difficult to be honest the main thing was just the embroidery making sure that the mouth and the eyes looked okay that that always takes me a bit of time because i do struggle with that the most but the actual crochet parts of this were very straightforward in terms of the body the arms and the leaves um so yeah i really like this pattern i really like how cute and small the mandrake turns out um and i really liked that the pdf simplified version of the pattern was available for free to download as well so i know a lot of the time you have to pay for pdf versions of patterns which i completely understand i charge for my own pdf pattern so i'd be a bit of a hypocrite to say that that's a bad thing to do um, i understand everyone's got to make money but i thought that was quite nice that they actually gave that away for free as well um and also there were no errors in the pattern Pattern that I found so I had no issues with the pattern at all I think it was a really really good one um so yeah if you're interested in making a mandrake from Harry Potter then I would definitely recommend trying out this pattern yourself so I hope you guys have enjoyed this very quick video and I'll see you in the next one bye guys